Hi, so, so just a really quick video on how to use Lit, my new amazing light emitting pigment. So first of all, what is it? This stuff is 100% pure light emitting pigment powder. It's a combination of a variety of different natural earth pigments, a couple of synthetic ones, and they've got a protective layer around them, which means you can mix them into stuff and make them into paint. What's different about this stuff than other glowing things is it will actually glow for up to 12 hours and it's bright enough to glow in some ambient lights, which means you don't need to be in the pitch black anymore to have a paint that emits light, which is absolutely amazing. Now, how do you use it? We've developed Lit to work perfectly with our super base. Now, for those of you that don't know what this stuff is, this is uh, an acrylic base that is more open than any other acrylic medium on the planet, which means this stuff holds more pigment than anything else, which means that when you put the glowing stuff in here, you get a super glowing paint. I'm gonna show you today how to do that how to get the ratio right and how to get an awesome effect. Point of note, you can mix lit straight into a linseed oil if you're an oil painter and you will get an amazing glowing paint. Unfortunately, I'm allergic to it, so I can't demonstrate it. You'll have to take my word for it. I'd love to see you do it and see what you come up with. Right, so what do you need? You need some super base or other acrylic medium but bear in mind, we recommend Super Base because it's going to hold more pigment, but it will work with other acrylic mediums. You need some lit and you need some water. Now, I urge you to experiment with different ratios. Get the feel right for your own work. We love making open source stuff that you can mix together, find your own recipes and really tailor your paint for your needs. You need some water, you need some lit, you need some Super Base and you need to get your ratios right. Now this is my favorite ratio and I'll show you how I do it. First of all, five parts of lit. Two, three, four, five. And you might not use a big great spoon if you only want to mix a little bit, but I'm using a spoon today to show you. So five parts lit, two parts water. In it goes. Right, give it a good old mix together and you'll see lit takes to water very, very, very nicely. But this stuff does need a binder. This is pure pigment. So if you were to paint with this now, as soon as it dried, the water dried out, it would just fall off. We don't want that. We want to use a binder. So, Super base, two parts for the mix I like. One, in it goes, two, oh, look at that, lovely, look at that. Give it a stir, it's almost like some kind of custard or something, it's beautiful. It's absolutely lovely to paint with. And there you have it, it's as simple as that. That is your light emitting paint. Now let me show you a couple of things that I made earlier. First of all, here's a canvas that we coated with lit and you can see that that looks absolutely amazing. Other things you can do, I've got a little torch here, this is quite fun. You can draw with light and if you paint this stuff over something really white like we've done on this little swatch here, it will reflect loads and loads of light, so it almost becomes super reflective. The other thing that's important to point out is, unlike other glow products, you can actually charge this stuff with heat as well. So if you warm your hands up loads and put them on it in a really dark room, it's gonna light up. You could put warm water on it, a hairdryer, I don't know. I know your imagination is probably a million times better than mine. I can't wait to see what you use it for. You're gonna come up with something amazing, I know. Please share your work on social media with the hashtag share the light. Share your light, share your work, share your colors. Make something amazing with Lit, and I'll be back soon when we've come up with something else. Have fun, bye.